In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to make a rainbow loom bracelet called the Long Cross Fishtail. What you're going to do is you're going to start with your loom and you're going to use six pins. So I'm going to be using these two rows of six. I'm going to start on the middle pin right here and I'm going to put black. I'm going to twist it and push it down. And now I'm going to jump to the one above it, make a parallel and push that one down. And for my last one, I'm going to put a band right here and I'm going to use um, rainbow colors. I'm going to be varying the colors. So first I'm going to do red. And that's how your bottom row looks. Next I'm going to start in the middle again, put it on. Now the one parallel right above it. And then here comes your long one. Put that on. Push it down. Now, just as in any other fishtail, you need three rows on, so I'm going to be doing my third row. So, start on the left with black. I'm going to be doing the next one. And I'm going to be doing two of each of the rainbow colors with the long cross. So, I'm going to do orange this time. Now, when you get them all on, you have three rows on, it's time to start taking them off. So you always want to take off from the bottom. So we're going to do in the exact same order as we put them on. We do these two, then the ones above it, and then the long piece. You want to push that down, and you want to put your next row on. So you start with the one on the left, put that on, then the one above it. And now I want to put my second orange one on. Okay. And now we want to take it off. So we do this one, then the one above it, and then the long piece. And push it down. And as you can see, I have the blue connector piece moved back so I have room for my bracelet to work its way down through the open area. So I'm just going to keep going on doing the same pattern. I'm going to do two blacks. Always start with the same one. Now I already put on two oranges so I'm going to do a long yellow piece next. And then I want to take them off. And I want to take off the long one and push it down. So I'm just going to keep going on in this pattern. I'm going to always keep the blacks in the same spot. And I'm going to, as I said, do rainbow for the long pieces. And you'll see, once the bracelet's done, your colors that are where the blacks are right now are going to be the front and back of the bracelet and then the rainbow colors are going to actually be the sides of the bracelet so you could just do a solid color if you wanted um, you could just do you know two blacks here and then just keep this long piece a solid color um, but I've chosen to do rainbow just for a variation or you could also do um, two different colors here and you know they'll make the, the it'll run vertically down the bracelet and you'll just have two different colors so you want to keep pushing it down now I'm back to blacks and let's see I need one more green And when you put the bands on, it's important not to overlap them. As I said, you want to have them in the same order on and off. So as you're putting them on, just make sure you're putting them, they don't go down and overlap the ones you already have on.
Now when your bracelet is to the length that you'd like it, you want to take the next layer off in the same pattern. So you start with this one, and then you do the one above it, and then you do the long piece. Pull it down. Now you should only have one rubber band on each peg. And so what you want to do is you want to take this one, and you want to grab the one across from it, and then you want to keep them both on, loop it through, stick it back on the peg. Now you want to take, I guess we'll do this one next, do the, blue, do the black, leave it on, grab the one diagonal from it, loop it through, and stick it on. And then the last one is the purple. Grab this, leave it on, loop it through, and now you want to pick up this one and loop it through and pick up your last one. Oops. Now you can pull it off and you can either loop it through so it's one single or you could leave it as two. I like to leave it as two. And then you want to get your S clip or your C clip. You want to hook it through. And you can take it off, come around to the other side, and you want to grab like two of these, and hook that through, so it's all together. And then here is your bracelet. It's black on the front and on the back, but the sides are rainbow.